When it comes to mobile phone plans in Canada, two of the most popular providers are Bell and Rogers. Each provider offers different features, pricing, and network coverage, making it challenging to determine which one is better. In this video, we will compare Bell and Rogers mobile phone plans to help you decide which provider is right for you. Coverage comparison, Bell vs. Rogers. One of the most important factors when choosing a mobile phone provider is network coverage. Bell and Rogers both have extensive coverage across Canada, but there are some differences. Bell has more extensive network coverage than Rogers, particularly in remote areas. Bell also has more 4G LTE coverage in rural areas, which means you are more likely to have better network connectivity when traveling outside of cities. However, Rogers has better coverage in urban areas and offers faster internet speeds in some areas. Pricing comparison, Bell versus Rogers. Another critical factor when comparing mobile phone providers is pricing. Bell and Rogers offer similar pricing structures, but there are some differences. Overall, Bell is generally more expensive than Rogers for comparable plans. For example, Bell's unlimited data plans start at $75 per month, while Rogers' equivalent plans start at $65 per month. Bell also charges additional fees for features like call display and voicemail, while Rogers includes these features in its plans. However, Bell does offer some unique features that may be worth the extra cost, such as the ability to share data across multiple devices and international roaming options. Plan Features Comparison, Bell vs. Rogers When comparing mobile phone plans, it is also important to consider the features included in each plan. Bell and Rogers both offer a range of features, but there are some differences. Both providers offer unlimited calling and texting within Canada, but Bell offers more international calling minutes than Rogers. Bell also offers a range of data plans, including unlimited data, shared data plans, and pay-as-you-go data plans. Rogers offers similar plans, but its shared data plans are more limited than Bell's. In terms of additional features, Bell offers the ability to share data across multiple devices, including tablets and smartwatches. Rogers does not offer this feature, but instead offers discounted rates for additional lines. Conclusion, Bell vs. Rogers In conclusion, Bell and Rogers are both popular mobile phone providers in Canada, and each offers its own unique advantages and disadvantages. Bell has better network coverage in remote areas and offers unique features like data sharing across multiple devices, and international roaming options. However, Bell is generally more expensive than Rogers, and Rogers offers better coverage in urban areas and faster internet speeds in some areas. Ultimately, the choice between Bell and Rogers will depend on your personal needs and preferences. If you live in a remote area or travel frequently internationally, Bell may be the better choice. If you live in an urban area and prioritize cost savings, Rogers may be the better option. It is essential to consider your usage requirements and budget when choosing between Bell and Rogers mobile phone plans.